Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm back with a new video and today I'll be discussing about a new topic. Till now, you would have heard about indoor landscape and outdoor landscape. That's the only common way you would have known to add greenery to your residence. Today I'll be discussing about something different and that is unconventional gardening. In this, I'll be discussing about various methods. You can use these methods in your unconventional spaces to make your residential interiors beautiful and attractive without much effort. Basically, this unconventional gardening is based on the need of residential buildings which have no space for gardening or the people who don't like usual gardening methods. And also, the people who own small houses and don't have enough space for gardening and the people who don't have their own houses but love to grow plants or the people who create for creative gardening methods. So, if you fall under any of these categories, then these methods are best suited for you. First, let's see what are the various unconventional spaces we have in the residential building. These are the list of unconventional spaces which you can see on your screen. These are the spaces which are sometimes left unused. So we can make better usage of these available spaces by unconventional gardening. Let's see how we can make best out of these spaces. Starting with balcony railing, as you can see in the picture, these areas can be decorated by the use of flowering plants. The ordinary baskets can be turned into wall planters by threading heavy gauge wire or using hooks. Various pots are also available for gardening in balcony railing. Our next unconventional space is wardrobe. A wardrobe can be made into an interesting piece of furniture by a vertical plant arrangement, which looks beautiful and decorative as well. Coming to walls. Walls can be decorated with trellis or creative pot holders. As you can see in the picture, readily available wall plant holders are also available in various shapes like tree, cycle, crisscross pattern and more. Next comes coffee table. The succulents can be planted to decorate a coffee table as shown in the picture which looks colorful and beautiful as well. The next one is staircase. You can use plants to enhance the appeal of the staircase by using them at the sides. Potted plants can be hung with the help of hooks in the grill and creepers can be used for the railing. Coming to space divider, you can make space divider by the use of plants as shown in the picture and here grouped arrangement of plants is done in the first one. You can use either potted plants or air plants can also be used to create a screen like appearance. The next one is kitchen countertop. The space above kitchen countertop can be used to grow plants as shown in the picture. It also adds to the decor. It is a new method of decorating your modern interior. Coming to dining table, a small filling in the center of table can be done to add interest and color to the boring dining table. It is a new method of decorating the furniture to add freshness to the interior. Our next unconventional space is ceiling. The ceiling areas can be decorated by a group of attractive indoor plants in hanging baskets or decorative containers which looks beautiful and decorative as well. The next one is shelves. Keeping the plants in decorative or customized shelves is another way to add beauty to potted plants. As you can see, they create an organized look when placed at various heights within an unconventional space. Here comes old books. This is one among the decorative planting method in interior which serves the aesthetic purpose and the reuse of old books. They can be placed anywhere like study table or coffee table to add freshness to the area. These were about the unconventional spaces for gardening and now let's see what are the accessories can be used for unconventional gardening. So these are the list of accessories which can be used to enhance the unconventional gardening area and now let's have a look at them. So the first one is lighting fixtures. Various beautiful and creative lighting fixtures are available. I have included some examples to give you an idea of how they can be used to add beauty to your unconventional gardening. So the next one is miniature sculptures. Here are some examples of miniature sculptures. They are very important for adding a touch of decor to the plants. 
They can be used in terrarium and potted plants as well. Here comes creative plant hangers. They actually increases the aesthetic appearance of plants and creates interest. They are various different types of plant hangers and various different colors of plant hangers are available. The next one is seashell. Just look at the pictures, how creatively they are being used. So this unconventional gardening is all about creativity. The next one is coconut shell. Coconut shells can also be used for keeping plants as you can see in these pictures. A touch of color increases its beauty and small leafy plants and succulents can be kept in these shells. Moving on to frames. These frames are available in various shapes and they can also be custom made according to your taste. So for, for making these beautiful frames, you just need a good carpenter and that's all you need. So you can make different frames like star, heart or your favorite alphabet or your favorite symbols or signs, any shape you can make and in that you can keep the beautiful succulents to add beauty to your interior. The next one is solar garden pebbles. They are also known as glowing pebbles or illuminating pebbles. These are like new in the market and many people are not aware of them. These pebbles are made from non-toxic luminescent and synthetic resin. As you can see, they are available in various colors. These stones absorb light during the day from sunlight or any other light source and then emit a beautiful tinted glow at night. In the picture, you can see that it has been used in the outdoor areas. So since I'm focusing on unconventional gardening in residential interiors, I can suggest you to use in aquaponics because they work well in water too. They can also be used in potted plants to give illuminating effect. Not only that, these pebbles can be used anywhere in the interior, wherever you want to give a touch of glow. Coming to economic factors. These methods, these unconventional gardening methods don't cost you much. They are affordable and they are suitable for all income groups. Moving to advantages, as we all know that plants play an important part in interior decoration. It not only makes the interior appealing but also filters the air and provides healthier, cleaner air for us to breathe. Green is a color of peace and from psychological point of view, they reduce physical and mental stress. They help us to relax and improve our health. So basically, if we see, they act as both functional and decorative. So these were about unconventional gardening in residential interiors. Comment down below what you feel about it and which method you like the most. Thank you for watching and spending your valuable time. Please give a thumbs up if you like my video and for more interesting topics subscribe to my channel also hit the bell icon to get notified about more academic and interior design videos.